Bottom wouldn't rape anybody. Bottom wouldn't do that. Like I'd be going out with a sicko. Well, we've just seen Mr. Tyler take him into the cure. He must have done something, Michaela. He's been framed. It's John Foster's versus Waterloo Road. If they can't get me, they'll get Bolton. You don't believe me. See this? That's what that stupid Helen teach thinks I sent her. Like we've really got it in for her. Look, they're setting us up. No way. Do you reckon? Ah, I'm gonna rip that Amy Porter's tongue out. You're gonna unsay it right now in writing. No! You're not going anywhere. Not until you start telling the truth. I'm not lying. As if my fault would ever fancy a snotty little cow like you. You're totally stupid. Do you really think he's only interested in you? He was snogging my face off. I could feel how hot he was for me. He just got mad because I didn't want to go all the way. Michaela, this has got to be a mistake. There's no way Bottom would have done this. Really? I saw him bringing himself up about it at break. No, well, not like that. Well, he wouldn't make out he was gagging for it, would he? Kim, what's all this stuff about Bolton smiling? Uh, there's an investigation into an incident. We don't know anything for sure yet. Well, I'm not teaching any rapists. <sighs> I thought the girls were bad enough. Hey, isn't it one of your lot whose mother's being done for murder? this morning in the toilet, she's got a massive bruise on her face. So just make sure you stay away from Bolton. Didn't think you were getting to tell the whole school. Serves him right. It was half Amy's fault. Oh, too bad, Siobhan. Now just shut up. Rapists never get done for it anyway. Sit down. What have you got my mum involved for? Sit down! Uh, do you mind if we just leave Bolton with his mum just have a little chat? Bolton, the reason I've had to get your mum involved is because legally you're still a child, all right? And if that's a... hand it over. No, I need to call my key to wash. Give it to me now. Thank you. Right. I want the truth about what's been going on. And I mean the whole truth! I'm not lying to you! Miss, can I go with it? Yeah, of course you can, Paul. What is it? I don't think it's Bolton's fault why he, why he lost it. I saw that girl coming on to him. Then she waited for him in the toilets. Then she got a friend to pretend that Mr. Mead was looking for me. When really she just wanted to get me out of the way. So I, th I think she wanted this. I know Bolton shouldn't have been bragging about it. Yeah, but... Hang on. But what? Bolton bragged about having sex with Amy. Well... No, it was more... So you tell me our six-foot lad can get assaulted by somebody that comes up to there! Eh? What does she do? Nail your feet to the floor? No! Because she didn't assault you, did she? Tell me the truth! All right, so I snubbed her! But that's all I did. I didn't even want to do it. She made me. But that's it, Mum, I swear, that's all I did. Right, and five minutes ago, you said nothing happened. So you're a liar! Oh, why is this happening to me? I just wanted to stop! Bolton, calm down. <sighs> well, I, I didn't even do anything, why don't no one believe me? What, what, like, I believed you damn but he said he never saw me again, eh? Candice, Candice. We're going to have to call the police, Bolton. Bolton! Open this door! Oh, wait, man, it's between me and her! Right, Max, listen to me. Um, oh, Candice, can you 
hold her off? Please, please. Um, leave it to me. No, honest, it's fine, it's fine. Just leave it to me. Bolton? Bolton, it's just me here now, Miss Campbell. But I need, I need you to just calm down, all right? I need you to talk to me. I'm talking to her. See how much trouble you've got me in. Don't hurt me. Bolton, you've got to let Amy out. You're going to tell them you lied? Please. Just to make things worse for yourself. I ain't letting her out till she fesses up. Tell her. Help! Look, the police are already on the way, Bolton. Andy's, we will sort it out. Trust me, I'll get you posted. Right, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. This is a total disaster. I would have never have had this happen at John Foster's. You can't tolerate no level dysfunction, Rachel. You have to stop it out. What, by humiliating and bullying punishments? God help our kids if you think that's the answer. Excuse me? Denzel Kelly, on his hands and knees, scrubbing the playground. I sent him to his class. You countermanded me? Yes, I did. Sue me. Oh, do you want me to get locked up for something I didn't even do? Tell her I'm not a rapist! God. If you take me to court, you've got to come as well. I've got to sit in front of all those people, hand on a Bible. You no, know, tell all these people, tell a judge all these lies you made up about me. Do you really want that? What do you think you're doing? Amy, are you all right, Amy? I just wanted to get back at him because he didn't want to go out with me. So you accused him of raping you? I was angry. He called me a slag and I'm not a slag. Yeah, you're a vicious little liar though, innit? Bolton. Well, that's gosh your face because that wasn't me either. Well? I hit it on the door when I was trying to stop him getting out. Have you got any idea how serious this could have been for him? Could have sent me to prison, man. Well, I never meant to do that. So what did you think was going to happen when you start making those kind of accusations? I don't know. Do you know what? It's because of a few stupid girls like you that lie that there's women and girls out there who do get raped and they don't get believed. I'm sorry. Do you know what? It's not bloody good enough. Do you know what? I'm going to get you some stuff to read about rape, about how it damages women's lives, and I want you to write me an essay on it. Then you might see just how selfish and how stupid oh, you've been. Well, it's okay now, miss. There's no need to go weep, is there? You do that, Amy, or you're excluded. This way, please, quickly. He's got a lot in an office. Amy, are you all right? She's completely unharmed. Where's Smiley? I let him go. What? He's not guilty of anything apart from stupidity. Who assaulted her then? Some other boy? It turns out nobody assaulted Amy, did they? No, miss. I don't understand. Amy? I'm sorry for wasting all your time. Come on, let's go and collect your things. Look, I'm, I'm really sorry that you were called out. It was a, a complete misunderstanding. It was a, a boy-girl tiff that just blew out of control. She was lying. Can I have everyone's attention, please? Thank you. Uh, Kim. Um, you all probably know that there was an incident of sexual assault reported this morning. 
It turns out that it was just a malicious rumour that got out of hand and Bolton Smiley is completely innocent. And I'm going to be making that very clear in assembly tomorrow. Look, we're really sorry if you've had to deal with disruptions in your classes this morning, but appropriate disciplinary measures have been taken. Meaning what? Well, it was a victory for Common Sense and Waterloo Road, so I thank you all for your patience and your professionalism. Now I hope we can close the subject off and move on. Have a good evening.